Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to set up our Roomba iRobot vacuum cleaner. Fortunately, we will need to use the iRobot app to get things set up first. Okay, we're going to get started. Get the iRobot app. Select your country. Agree to all that. Select your device. Of course, this will work with the the mops. All right, get your Wi-Fi ready. Charging station set on the ground. It's gonna give you an idea where to put it. You can name your robot. I named mine robot. Find your Wi-Fi. You're gonna press down and hold your two buttons on your device. Now that you've pressed these two buttons on your vacuum, you've now connected to your Wi-Fi. You'll be able to control your vacuum with the app, but ultimately we want to control this with our voice and our Alexa devices. Still a few more steps to go. Here we go. Okay, connect to your network. Yeah, we just did that. Connect Roomba. And now it's going to walk you through a series of advice. <laughs> okay, from there we can just hit vacuum everywhere if we wanted to on that button. But now we're going to connect it to our Alexa devices and use voice commands. Okay, now we are switching from the iRobot app to the Alexa app, and we're going to choose Find a New Device. Found two. Found my robot. I'm going to select that one. All right, here's going to ask for my password. So I'm not going to show you that screen, but it was that easy. Once I put the password in, it was ready to use, and there's my device showing up on screen. Okay, so all we've done with the Alexa app is enabled voice commands. So now you'll be able to speak to your Alexa device to control different functions of your Roomba. You'll still want to use the iRobot app to monitor battery power, uh, filters, and things like that. All right, now you're set up to use voice commands for your Roomba. 